a Russian organization having some expertise in online information security, keep running by Natalia Kaspersky, is presenting a cell phone which is Snoop verification and stops Google, Microsoft, Facebook, IBM, NSA, CIA, GCHQ, FIS, CSE, NRO, and some applications, from keeping an eye on clients. After Edward Snowden uncovered that the National Security Agency approaches Google's server farms around the world, Russian President Vladimir Putin looked to decrease Russia's dependence on American multinational tech organizations. Bloomberg reports. The Tiger Telephone, outlined by Moscow-based InfoWatch Group and named after destroyed woods in Siberia, runs its own particular Android-based firmware that lets applications keep running on the gadget yet prevents them from gathering information. The telephone likewise has a worked-in specialist that gives the chairman dash, for example, a corporate IT division, control over what applications will take a shot at the gadget and what content the client can access or offer. Most cell phone applications gather certain information on clients and send it to outside servers said Natalia Kaspersky, head of InfoWatch. At the point when individuals utilize individual telephones at work, their corporate messages, archives and occupation-related photographs go under danger of being, noxiously or coincidentally, spilled to outsiders. InfoWatch is wagering on a request in Russia in the midst of worries over client information gathered by U.S.-based organizations, for example, Google and Facebook. The initial 50,000 Tiger telephones, made in China, will be conveyed to workers of Russian organizations co-possessed by the state. Potential markets likewise incorporate Malaysia and the United Arab Emirates, where InfoWatch has opened workplaces. Kaspersky helped to establish hostile to infection maker Kaspersky Lab and ran it before her separation from accomplice Eugene Kaspersky. President Donald Trump has of late limited the utilization of Kaspersky lab items by U.S. government elements over the company's affirmed ties with the Russian government. Kaspersky now maintains her own particular business and works in a Kremlin-supported working gathering on data innovation power. Vladimir Putin is trying to lessen Russia's dependence on organizations, for example, Microsoft Corporation What's More. International Business Machines Corporation in the midst of geopolitical strains with the U.S. over Ukraine and Syria. Russia offered haven to U.S. outlaw Edward Snowden, who uncovered that the National Security Agency approached Google's server farms around the world, and a neighborhood TV channel this year ran a satire arrangement around an American government operative at Russia's biggest gaseous petrol maker Gazprom PJSC.